Uncle Sam has come to town. Miss Eileen. Damn. There we go, right there. That's what I'm talking about. What did I tell you before you go? If you don't know what you're talking about, if you got a special account or something like that, guess what? I don't want that. I told you. You want to know it? Good credit. She got to have 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 good credit. What you got to say to me, baby? Yeah, come on, come on now. Ooh. I just, damn, I like that girl. I got that girl. I got that girl. I like that girl. Ah. All right, I'll finally show you. This is where I come. Used to be owned by the Russian mob. No longer. All right. The Banya Cafe. See that right here. This is my little hat. This is my Banya hat. My Banya hat right here. Yep. Yeah, this is my Banya hat. My Banya hat. You see this right here? You use this to beat your feet with. That's it right here. You want to live? Where I live, there's a jacuzzi right here, that's the pool. I'm going to take you for a tour, a very nice place. I can't tell you where, because you don't live like this. Oh, God. Woo! This is the finished song. You people. I don't know what the hell to tell you. You live like shit. You, 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 Ameri you black Americans, I don't want to know what it is to live like you. You're not, I'm European, for so crying out loud. I was taught. I've been raised by these people. My mother paid a whole lot of money from where I came from, Haiti. As a little French prince. I'm not ashamed. I went swimming in a freaking ghetto because I like your big booty black babes. Biggest freaking mistakes I ever made and I cut the crap out and I'm into cute white girls with good crap. What? I haven't touched any woman in nine years. I'm a virgin again. Bingo! Bang! Ooh, yeah. I'm gonna go have me a drink. Have a little caviar and crepes. A little boy soup. And I'm going to go outside and smoke a cigarette. How you doing? Look, I'm trying to be nice to you. I've been trying to be tolerant. And... I tried not to show you. What a bunch of classes pieces of crap I've been trying to arrange to be equal and then I couldn't tell it to anybody. Well, put my little body hat on. Thank God for my family, my great grandfather. Who has morality to his religion that trickled down to us and we are still moral and kind, inclusive, and love everybody. I love African Americans, man. That's why I'm writing a book to get your reparations while y'all got a black present in your country. I'm sorry, I haven't seen Obama or Michelle Obama do shit for black niggas in America about anything and it's publicized. 
And now he's attacking Libya. Well, shit. Without authority from Congress, he should be impeached. I campaigned for him. I love him. I think he should get a second term. So I hope Mr. Biden bullshit about what he said about Bush don't get so bad about Obama that the Republican Congress, because the Republican Congress, they can put an impeachment thing together before the next round of elections, but I plan on having my book make the biggest freaking impact about every one of y'all, about racism, all the way on up to the Secretary of State. That's Hook to the former president, and I believe all your bullshit is what led to me getting fucked and put out of my home. Look, man, I don't give a dead going. I don't have to be polite to you. I'm not even talking to you. I'm talking about you to a whole bunch of people that I want to shit on your life. Fuck you over. I want to muster everything I can to fuck every one of y'all in power over Dethrone y'all, because you're a piece of the shit that helped destroy my life. Bitch. Fuck you. I don't care what hands are want you to be nice. I ain't screwing you, baby. So guess what? I don't fuck no women. Why? I want to keep my power to myself rather than fucking give it to you. Bitch. I want respect. That will lead to you admiring me. Because I'm such a great motherfucker. Other than that, kiss my ass.